Hey guys, Clay here from Badger Security and Survival, and today we have another Survival or Bust, our new series. Today, we have a bivy bag. I don't know how well it's going to work, but that's the point of this series. Let's do this. This bivy bag is pretty basic. Uh, there's tons of other brands out there that look exactly the same when you take it out. I'm actually gonna test this and uh, see how well it works. What, what temp we got? Uh, I don't know, it says complete heat retention and I think it's full of it. So we're gonna give it a try. But to be completely fair, I'm gonna do it in what I actually wear on a consistent basis. Feels Granted, like it's 13 degrees. feels like 13 right now, so not exactly warm. Uh, but I'm gonna do it in what I would, if I was forced out and I had to leave my jacket or I lost it or whatever, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna give her a shot. But that's, uh, I've had socks that are thicker than this, so I don't think it's gonna work. But let's give it a shot. Try and cut this open without. Uh, Cut my warp sack. Knives are cool. All right, now, when we bought this, we didn't know that it was a small. <laughs> so keep that in mind. I'm assuming that's what this on the bottom means. I'm assuming it means small, but it doesn't say small anywhere on it. 84 by 36 inches, so I should be just fine getting in it. Maybe. Let's give it a shot. There, this is in no way gonna help me survive, by the way. If I had just this, I'd be screwed. It's like trash bag material. I think this is mostly so just so they can find your body when you die out here. Oh yeah, this is gonna do absolutely nothing. Well, it's blocking the wind. This is actually not that bad. <laughs> this is that part where it's like a few moments later. It's actually not that bad in here. I am in the sun, but just blocking off that wind was a huge plus. So I don't know whether it's that or not. All right, now sun's going down. It's time to take a nap. So here's the real test. Yeah, that's cold as hell. Oh. Yeah, I'd, uh, I'd definitely be uh, frostbite butt cheeks. Feels like I'm laying directly on snow. <laughs> oh. I don't know, if I had to rough it out and lean up against something, I could probably get away with it. Yeah. Free freezer burned the back of my arm. Uh, yeah, maybe, maybe in a car, maybe inside of a cold shelter that doesn't have heat anymore, that might work. But, I mean, I suppose it's it's better than a bucket of water over you. Not much. <laughs> Defense, zero. <laughs> so some some final thoughts on this. Biggie bag, which personally I would, I think that's mislabeling. Uh, I would not use this as a sole bivy bag in pretty much any condition. Maybe rain, if it was warm rain. Maybe. 
but I think Bivy is pushing it a bit. Uh, and as always, it never goes back into the same size package that it came in. But at least this one, it's possible to fold back up and put back in there. But I'm going to have to go with Bust on this. Because for a tenth of the price, this is 11 bucks. For a tenth of the price, you can get the Kevlar Reflective Blankets that are basically the same size, and you could get 10 of them and actually build a shelter, as well as have much more coverage. Uh, and it takes up just the same amount of room. Two of those Kevlar, or the Mylar, not excuse me, not Kevlar, Mylar blankets would take up the same amount of room. They also have the same problem. Now, that's not to say that it wasn't warm when I was standing, uh, especially in the wind. It cut a lot, but Bibby implies sleeping outdoors with no other cover. That's the definition of Bibby, and I think it's mislabeled for that. It also didn't stand up to much movement all that well. Uh, there's a couple holes in it when I put it back into the bag, which wouldn't completely deter it from being used. But I'm going to have to go with Bust on this. There's better options for way less money that can actually be used in more functions than just this one. I will say that if you had one blanket and one of these, you could cut this open and it would be larger dimensions. But I still think that the two blankets would be a better option. All right, so there you have it. Second survival or bust is a bust, at least in our opinion. If you have something around the same price point or you have a different reason why this would be a good option for you, please let us know in the comments below. Hit us up on Facebook, check out our YouTube, and until next time, make yourself ready.